Yeah, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm a Paul Rich Professors. I shall be discussing one of the talent issues in society, especially as a lawyer, as a law student. This is one of the things you meet in your legal method. You see me that are going on, not just in legal method, but that is the starting aspect of it. It is called law and morality. What do you understand by, it, by this, this statement? There is what is called divergence and convergence aspect of this two of us. And so we use it as a devil. Let's start by the word law. Law is a rule of policy that regulates human behavior, businesses, and anything that has been within conduct within human conduct that is must be sanctioned if violated. So law does not have a general law does not have a general universal definition. Then let's come to morality. What is morality? Morality has to do with something of right and wrong. Is it right or wrong? Like Bible, like Quran. So this is this is this is the two definition of the two words, which is morality and law. Then let's talk about the divergence aspect of it. Uh, we we'll come to Nigeria. In Nigeria, we we'll talk about um, uh, uh, let me I use about three examples. Number one example is. If I slap you now, it means an offense. It is a criminal offense. It is a source of battery. The law of thought it is, it is battery. In criminal law, it is assault. So, as a matter of general, it is assault. Let's just, let's, just, let's just assume that. Then, in Bible, if you slap someone, I'm using Bible as an example, it is wrong, but they will not do anything. Because the Bible says the Bible says that once someone slaps on this one, we should bring the other one let him slap it too. That is wrong. The this is divergence. This is divergence aspect of it that it is wrong in the law, but it's not wrong in the Bible. The Bible will tell you bring the other one, may slap it too. I don't want again you, you give an example as an example of gazing. Gazing, gazing is bad. I want to use Nigeria as an example. Gazing is bad in Nigeria. Is 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 against the law in Nigeria. But, we, but, but, but in the biblical aspect of it, it is wrong. Because the Bible made us know that we should marry opposite sex. We should go to the world and multiply. Not to marry each other, not to marry male and male. That's another example. Then there's a many examples. Another example again is an um, example of um, morality and law is lying. When someone lies, when someone lies to you, it is not it is not illegal. You cannot enforce. You cannot go and sue someone say that he lied. No, but in the Bible it is against the law. You don't lie. They say do not lie. Do not tell lies. It is against the Bible. So so this is this issue I want to bring out. So what am I saying? What am I saying? It is that morality has to do with wrong and right. Law has to do with uh, 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 coming together by maybe selected some people, maybe selected, selected individuals, or as or, or has to assemble a national assembly or certain individual to make a law that will be binding. If 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 breached or violated, it will be sanctioned. It will be sanctioned by the by the prescribed punishment or penalty ascribed for it so that is different between two of them thank you for watching my youtube channel i tell you about the task icon and please subscribe like and comment if you have any problem or any issue in listening to my uh, lecture please you can just comment i will discuss that i will, I will reply thank you very much i appreciate it.